Alright guys, this is Mithril back with another item guide video and today we are here in the Fight for Sanctuary DLC here in the back burner and what we're doing today is the BFFF's quest get it here from Brick so we're going to be doing it together Dang, a whole village, huh? Man, he's pretty tough. Even with a Norfley, I'm not able to kill him right away. Oh, would it be dropped? Oh, I can't believe it. He also dropped the world burn. All right, we are here at Lieutenant Angvar's. Right, much easier to go down. Lieutenant Tetra was last seen somewhere in Helios. That guy would start a pandemic if it meant winning a fight. Okay, we are here at Lieutenant Tetra's. You're nothing but a bunch of raiders! Where is this guy? There he is. Alright, we are here at Lieutenant Hoffman. Gotta wait for the cutscene. You can actually drop a sniper that's not supposed to be in the game. I think it's this right here. It's just a purple. But if you take it and uh, save quit, it disappears from your inventory. Alright, now let's go bring back the parts. Okay, I guess now we just wait for Brick. Uh-huh. Yep, I see what he's doing. There we go. Now come on, Slab. Go give that rifle to Mordecai. Alright, now we just gotta go over here and give Mordecai his gift. Good for Mordecai. Oh, thanks, man. You remember? Couldn't have done it without Talon here. Makes me want to be like a better guy, you know? That's right, Miho. Good boy. Good boy. Hey, thanks, Brick. Thanks for the help, Slab. All right, and you that turn it in, and then you get right the there. legendary Amigo hey, Sincero. I had some extra parts. So let's take a look at it. There it is. Okay. It's got that wood finish because it's a Jacobs. But other than that, it's got like this camo on it. K 
can't say I'm too much of a fan of that. But anyways, it's red text is a true friend can penetrate any barrier. What that means is damage ignores enemy shield. It has increased damage. It's got reduced fire rate. It's got a fixed scope and melee attachment. So yeah, like every other unique item from this DLC, it's pretty much just a reskin of another item from somewhere else in the game. So the Amigo Sincero is basically just the better version of the Trespasser. So let's go find some enemies to uh, shoot at. All right, so I'm here in Three Horns Valley. I like coming to Bad Mall. And since it, this gun goes through enemy shields, who better, right? As you can see, I am damaging his health bar and not his actual shield. Fortunately, it doesn't seem to go through shields, like physical shields. Hmm. But as a actual damaging gun? It honestly doesn't do that much damage. If you're gonna use it, I would use it like off-handing with Sal. I mean, that's what most people use the Trespasser for, right? Is when you fight Laura. Or maybe Pyro Pete. Because as you can see, it is uh, not good. I'll throw down the turrets and then we could try again. Alright, that was good on that guy with the crit. Hubert, can you stop? Maybe crits are the way to go if you have good aim, unlike me. Wow, that actually did a lot. Is there any more uh, bandits over here? No, there isn't. Alright. So yeah, that was a pretty good demonstration. As you guys can see, through Bad Maul, he was doing damage to his health bar, not his shield. Getting anything that's not a crit is pretty much not worth your time, even when they're slagged. But doing those crits actually did huge damage. 